Hi, this is Jamie Davis, the Pod Medic from MedicCast TV Weekly Commentary here with another episode. We're covering some tips for EMS students right now, and of course, if anybody can use these tips or pass them on to the students you know. So pay attention, folks. Today, we're talking about the brain dump. Brain dump? What's that? Well, let's listen up. Come on, lean in, lean in. Brain dump. It means taking the stuff that's in your brain up here and dumping it onto a blank piece of paper right here. Now, what do I mean by that? What do I mean by a brain dump? Well, a person who's a lot smarter than I am, Albert Einstein, made the statement once that he never committed to memory something he could write down on paper. Why waste the space in your brain to write, and if you can just write something down? This is especially true when you're taking a test. You ever taken a test and you get to a point where you have an answer that you just know the answer, but you can't seem to lay your fingers on it in your brain? Well, if you brain dump beforehand, you can solve that problem. So take the stuff out of your brain, and put it onto the piece of blank paper or in the margin of your test or the back of your test. If you're taking a national registry test, they will provide you a whiteboard and a dry erase marker to take in with you. So you, if you do need to write something down or do calculations, they can all be there. It's a great place to put your brain dump. You can put your rule of nines for burns there, draw yourself a little burn stick figure. Uh, you can keep track of your respiratory gases, medication doses, ACLS basic guidelines or mnemonic, mnemonic tools, whatever you need to do, put them down. Now you practice this ahead of time. When you study, practice what you're going to put down on your brain dump. It'll help your brain work a little better. And when you go into the test and the test begins, find where you're going to put your brain dump. Maybe they let you bring in some blank scrap paper, or maybe you just have to write it on the back of the test or in the margins. But go ahead and utilize the brain dump to allow you a better way to succeed as an EMS student. I'm Jamie Davis, the Pod Medic. I'll have tips like this, commentary, occasionally rants and reviews, all here on the MedicCast TV weekly commentary. And you can find that at MedicCast.tv. You'll also find there the weekly full video segment of the long episode podcast. If you listen to the audio podcast, you'd like to know that there's also a video version. You can find that over at MedicCast.tv as well. So until next Friday, I urge you to find your own tips and share them with me over at MedicCast.tv. Just leave a comment under this particular segment.